Welcome back to my channel today. It is Monday the 28th of June, so we're nearly in July as I'm filming this and today I am going in for my final the three college exams and then after that I'll most likely never have to go to college ever again. So it kind of feels really weak today because also all the tutors in college have to be off because of this new testing thing. So this is going to be like a lot of students in college and no teachers. That's going to be really weird, but yeah. Anyway, as I do have the three exams today, I did some revision last night. We've got the hot stones and also microdermabrasion. So I've been making notes, stuff and highlighting key points. So, you know, revision is important if you want to pass your exams. And I have passed all of my other exams. So I better pass these ones because otherwise I may not be able to resit them. I'm not quite sure, but like... Yes, the college is all a bit up in the air. Also, I cut my hair this morning and the one half of my hair is really short and the other half is really long. So, I don't know what's happened there, but it's fine. I also did my makeup. I used my Morphe 35 XO palette and I also used the Peach and Cream Most Wanted Pigment. And also, I do have a new pair of eyelashes on. The Wispies Luxe eyelashes. They are beautiful. Look at them. They're so nice. Also... Uh, my top is from Topshop and my jeans are from Primark as well. So yeah, and I think I will be setting off at my house at around 10 o'clock because the exam isn't until 11, but it's actually my friend's birthday soon and I probably won't be able to see her um, when it's her birthday because that will be finished college. So I've got like a little Joma jewellery pair of earrings and a card and stuff, so... I'm going to give her those today for her, her birthday. She will be turning 18, so, you know, I've got to get her an 18th birthday present plus. She got me an 18th birthday present. So, Ella, if you're watching this, I hope you had a lovely birthday. A good 18th. Hopefully, it wasn't too restricted being in this whole situation at the moment, you know. But yeah, but anyway, I need to revise for this. The time is currently 25 past 9, and as I said, I'll be setting off it. 10 because i'll get to college for around whatever time i said before half 10 and this is my lanyard guys awful ugly photo of me lovely look at that but yeah it's probably the last time i'll i'll ever wear this lanyard so yeah kind of sad i still have my old one in, like in my box somewhere but i'll have to keep these for the memories as well how cute <laughs> How bloody cute. I'm back home now everybody. It is a good few hours later. I've been in the house for like around half an hour or something and the exams, can I just say, oh my god, they were horrendous. But we had to have a Teams meeting at 12 o'clock and me and my friends were outside and spoons having our lunch and one of our friends went on the Teams meeting and our tutor told us that uh, like me and my friends had passed and a few other people had passed but a few people had failed but we passed the first three exams and we did have the third exam at three o'clock in the afternoon and that was absolutely awful as well but i've not found out the results of that yet so i'm kind of worried in case i filled it because the resets are going to be next week but next week me and scott are going to newcastle so i might not be able to go to college to do them so fingers crossed they wish me good luck guys i've passed them i'll pass the microdermabrasion next time because i did pass the other two but anyway i'm home and i've got changed into some shorts because i was too hot wearing jeans oh my god like it, it takes me half an hour to walk from college back to home again so like half an hour both ways and oh my god it's so warm outside as well so yeah i had to get changed into shorts i did also put some more Garnier this is my body on my legs because I put it on my arms and neck and up half my body last night and it's given me like a natural glow but because I've got shorts on now my legs are literally so pale look at that pale legs so I've put some on also I don't know if I've told you guys but I'm going to Scott tonight because I don't have college tomorrow because I passed my exams and people are only getting and people are only really going for resets now, but I've passed them. So, uh, I'll be going to his, so like, I will have to pack my hold all after 
after this part of the vlog because I will be setting off you know, I'll drop my sister and her friend off at netball at around six o'clock and then we're going straight to his house so I'm excited to see him but anyway when me and my friends were on our like three and a half hour break we did go like into town obviously because like you know, that's the only place where you can go in town to get stuff Um, I'm not really able to sit down because my legs are still kind of sticky you have the gotcha tie on and I don't I really want it to come off my legs so I don't know how I'm gonna do this I have to stand here and show you guys like this so I apologize so I went to TK oh my god please excuse all the washing let's move that out of the way because we don't want to see that mess I went to TK Maxx as you guys can see and I picked up a couple of items because in TK Maxx they sell this Ted Baker perfume that I actually own and I get it from TK Maxx every time it's in there because it's actually beautiful. I'm going to show you it. It's basically this Ted Baker Poly perfume. It's absolutely stunning. It's a 50ml perfume. It smells unbelievable. It actually smells so nice. I'm going to put this on me right now because it'll smell good. But they actually had this today in TK Maxx for a whopping £8. Um, it used to be £18 and now it's £8, so £7.99. And this is this Ted Baker Poly perfume. However, this one is a 30ml, so it's slightly smaller, but still, it's fine. It's absolutely beautiful. Even though it's a really cheap perfume, it lasts a long time on your skin and clothes. And the packaging is beautiful. It's like a lovely rose gold. But because this one's smaller, I think it might just be like a little thinner one, unless it's similar to that. But it just says poly mixtures. has a little tea inside. Honestly, TK Max is great for going shopping in. Oh my god, it's so cute. It's it's so small and tiny and it's actually perfect for putting in your handbag. So this is the 50ml here. This is my old one, this is the 30ml. How cute are they? Oh my god, they're actually really nice and this perfume is a bargain, even full price as well. £18 for this, it's amazing. That's the first thing I got and I'm really happy about that. And then final thing, the TK Maxx at the moment are really pulling through with all their skincare bits. They do actually sell a lot of like Korean kind of Japanese skincare and if you don't know guys the japanese and korean skincare is some of the best on the market they had all sorts of stuff but i decided to pick up it is glam fox ultra Revit revital collagen solution mask it's 6.99 and the reason i bought this is because it makes your skin look it makes your skin look younger it feels really weighty inside and obviously it's korean or japanese i'm not quite sure where it comes from I don't actually say it just like it's all they're basically like the foreign the words on the back but it was like a massive box and i do really like a good face mask by the way guys it actually really hurts my back standing up like this i've tried to put it up a bit more because my back is actually shaking me now i'm hoping that stays oh yeah it's oh my god it's way better that is way better that is oh my god 10 times better Kind of, yeah. So here it is, the packaging is really cool. I just want to open them and, and see what they look like. Hopefully they'll be individually individually wrapped. I can't say that. But it is 6 99 Honestly, I do you know, like spending money on skincare now. I never used to, but ever since I went to college and did beauty therapy, it's kind of made me realise that you need to look after your skin as much as you can because you only get the one skin and if you don't look after it it'll start to show like as you get older and stuff i finally got it open guys look honestly i oh my god there's actually loads in here look oh my god it's about ten thousand. Oh my god this is so good for the price oh my word this comes with one two three four five six seven eight nine wait two four six eight oh my god it comes with 10 face masks and these were seven pounds each like what and oh my god the packaging is so cute oh my god i wish this was to add but it's not so if any like skincare brands or makeup brands want to hit me up on these because i am very happy right now like look at that i am actually um, like i'm just shocked like i've got all these for £15 which I think is pretty good considering perfume is really expensive and the skincare can be quite expensive so I will let you know 
know what I think of these because obviously like the people they like to try new skincare kind of stuff don't know but I head over to your local TK Maxx and have a look because you will find some good bargains in there and the TK Maxx in my kind of town or city is really good for like stuff like that so I highly recommend what a bargain um i am super impressed decisions decisions guys i don't know what to pack as per usual but i think i might pack these new primark shorts they're like a denim pair and they're like the raw hem at the bottom in a size six but i have noticed how my waist has got smaller ever since i got my new job um working somewhere i'm not gonna say where it's in case you never know who's watching these days but yeah these are like yeah, these are like a lovely dark hem wash um and have like a couple of rips in them which i like the detail of and yeah, these are 12 pounds so i'm gonna pack those but then i need to decide what top to wear with them because i'm only wasting them for one night but i like to do i like to pack a couple of outfits in case i end up staying for like another night pack my sports bra and my sports seconds in case i want to go out in case i just want to like I don't know, just, yeah, just in case something happens, you know, and I think I'll pack like a little crop top, a little white one, because they can go with the, uh, what are they called, shorts and also my little top as well, and my little gym leggings, but then I'll also pack another top just in case, because you never know, it might be a bit cold, I don't know what to pack, you know, I might actually pack, I might just pack a white body soon. It's not being funny, but it, like it's 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 fine. I like thinking about it. It's just so boring to play in my outfits, but yeah. If if that's what I want to wear, that's what I want to wear. So I'm just gonna pack some pretty little thing. Pretty little thing actually do some really nice body suits. I've not ordered off there in ages, so so leave a comment if you'd like to see a little PLT haul. Cause I'll probably film one. I'm obviously going away with, with Scott to Newcastle. So I'm trying to save money for there and of course I will do like a little shopping haul but I'm trying to save my money because I'm trying to reach like a milestone like you for money kind of thing. They like try to get to like a certain number in bank accounts, that's what I'm doing right now. But I've been pretty good with saving. Like even though I do like to spend a bit of money on Vov and DHgate and Primark and stuff, I still you managed to save a, like a quite a big chunk of my money so it's pretty rewarding when you can look at your bank account and say oh i've been able to save like this much money because like, it just makes you feel a lot better i'm also packing pj shorts how cute are these i got these the last year in primark guys oh my god primark like, pj shorts are the cutest and they're so comfortable these are in extra small how cute are they they're gorgeous and then that's where like a little top i do need some more like the PJ tops because some of these are getting a bit old now. Can you kind of see? You kind of going like a bit like, yeah. So yeah, but this is all I'm packing. I've also got like all my underwear and socks in there, but I'm not really going to show. Like that's a bit weird. Um, I really want to pack my new little perfume because like I'll be able to put it in my handbag, but I need to use this one up. Shall I bring this one and and use it up, and I can I can use this one another time. Yeah, it's probably a good idea. But oh my god. They definitely keep your eyes peeled. They do have like a few too big perfumes, but the majority of them are in the black packaging. I've never tried the black ones before, so I don't know if they smell nice or not. But if you ever spot the poly perfume, definitely have a look because it's so nice. Right, I am. That's got now. I completely forgot to vlog, but that's what. She's been here three days. I, I've not been here three days. I've been, like, I've been here for like a couple of hours, but anyway. They were cleaning the fish tank out because it needs cleaned. And one I'm of our... Them the dead fish, that's nasty. Oh, yeah. No, but I might have vegans watching. Our Siamese fighting fish, anyway, has passed away, but I'm not going to show you. Because it's in that bowl down there, but I'm not going to show you that. But he was cleaning the tank out because it needs cleaned. So this is behind the scenes of Scott who cleaning his fish tank. And... We might have dead fish after this because the way I'm moving my hand around. I know. That's why that... I want one of those long ones so they can. You know what, what they should invent? A self cleaning what? fish tank. Yeah, they should. But. But they're not gonna. This is the joys of cleaning the fish tank. There's about 10,000 babies in there. We may not all survive. We'll just have to find out. But yeah. 
it's looking a bit grimy at the moment, but it'll look a lot better once everything is in there. And tomorrow morning it'll be fine once yeah. everything's settled down. Just leave it like that. No. I scrubbed it enough now. Yeah. So if you're thinking about getting a fish tank, you just consider cleaning it because it is. It can be like a bit hard work sometimes, but. But you shouldn't clean it too well. No, because you need like a bit of bacteria in there as well, don't you? That's why it only does about uh, forty yeah. percent change. I was going to do another bucket, but no. you're best doing it after a while. Yeah. Doing it halfway. Yeah. And then again in a week, do another halfway. Uh, but I probably won't do it in another week. If you're just cleaning tips with Scott Melvin, if you want. Start a YouTube channel. A YouTube channel, we actually should. Uh, how I clean my fish tank. How, how I clean my. A 60 litre by all. I used to always watch videos of people getting new fish and things. Oh my god. I really want another fish tank. Well, if you can find the space and no, find the time. I don't, I don't have the time at the moment. No. Yeah, but anyway, Alice is still here. You're the one that I bought you for Christmas, was it? Oh, was it Valentine's Day? It was Christmas, wasn't it? The fish tank? No. The teddy. Oh, you're Alice, there. Uh, yeah, she's. She's been dead a while. Yeah. It's kind of creepy, you know, Valentine's, but it's fine. I think. Yeah. Oh. Valentine's. Oh, Valentine's. And here's a photo of us too. Look how nice that is. Don't show them a dusty shelf. No. I love that photo of us too, you know. It's actually really I'll give cute. one dusting because you dust them 30 seconds later, it's dusty. Yeah, that's true. And then he's got one of these saying, you don't have to be anything other than yourself. And then, like, it's just got like a cool kind of record kind of thing. And apparently, it's Tuesday, the day for April today. Yeah, I'm a traveller. <laughs> time traveller. The turn back time. I'll change oh, wow. that. Oh, oh, we're watching the sunset tonight. It looks incredible on my phone. And there's Scotland over there, and here's Scott. <laughs> look at him. Look at him posting on here. And then. I'm shy lately. I know you are. Look how nice Scotland looks. Mm. That is Scotland. 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 You know where I want to take you for um, camping? Where? It's like a little island up there. <laughs> and there's all the windmills over there as well. Oh, damn. You look at that. Stop. Don't put <laughs> that anywhere. Are you getting embarrassed? Don't put that oh, that's his nice, sexy car. Blur out the reg. Oh, I didn't put the reg in, actually. But look. Oh, look, you in it. You yeah, in it. Oh, <laughs> look how beautiful that is. Next day, everybody now, and I'm in Scott's car, but he's not here because he's at work. Um, like, he started work at one o'clock and he finishes at half two and it's currently quarter to two but like I went in a few shops and I got everything I needed um so I'm waiting in this car because he gave me his keys so yeah I'm keeping his, his car it's nice and safe but honestly it's actually boiling outside like it's so warm and like I kind of feel like I feel as if I shouldn't be like sitting in the car but then I'm not like as familiar of where I am around here, so I wouldn't I want to get lost and stuff. But yeah, but anyway, I don't want to grab my makeup on my face because I actually forgot my makeup. So I did head over to Superdrug because I had a lot of deals on, um, and I I was in need of oh, like of some makeup it's for myself anyway. Oh, and I actually got a Scott a card. Um, a thank you card for when he leaves work this, this Thursday coming because he will be leaving his job to actually do cake full time it's very exciting but anyway I've got some Spectrum makeup brushes and I set for 5 49 which looks really good and this brush was like £3 Spectrum is really good it's like a, a rose quartz 804 brush and it's like a tapered kind of like a blending kind of brush but i'm probably going to use this as like for bronzer because yeah the city me it didn't even bring any of my stuff with me but the spectrum makeup brushes are some of my favorites especially the eye ones i love them so much 
then I also got the X Beauty Blender because I needed one and yeah, these were actually cheaper compared to Super Drug Zone so like and I love these so much so I might as well use them so I got that for $4.99 then I got an MUA bronzer because I don't have bronzer with me and it's in Sunset Tan and MUA bronzer is much really good and it's like a massive bronzer for £4 then I actually got a good deal on these foundations so I don't know if, if you guys know but I use the Maybelline the Superstay foundations all the time and I've been actually got these for like £6 each so I got one in ivory one in light bisque and also soft bronze so I can use these on clients and stuff as well like I myself obviously but the coverage of these foundations I highly recommend them um, and then I think the final thing I bought from Super Drug was a face powder like I was gonna buy the Revolution one but they didn't sell any so I got myself this MUA one it's just like a, a pro base one I've never tried it before but MUA makeup is quite good like it's cheap but the majority of the stuff is quite good so yeah that's the thing I bought so yeah they weren't too bad to be honest and I'm now gonna be able to put makeup on if it's got the only thing I don't have is oh I forgot to bring out eyelash glue oh dear but I won't put any eyebrows on because I can't put my eyebrows I should have bought a glue but I can't put the fine glue oh well it's fine I'll just have to deal with it but it is more stocked up on the, on the makeup bits because these foundations are sold out everywhere Um, where I live they literally sold it in the shades that I want for them to be in so but they literally had like every shade available in there so I was quite buzzing about that and you know, these brushes are actually stunning how pretty are they love them but anyway I'm just gonna sit in the car I've got myself a cherry Dr Pepper first every time I've actually tried a Dr Pepper drink but it, it actually it's so good the cherry you know, the cherry kind of taste does taste a bit fake but I mean it's fine but I'm now a bit scared to look at my bank balance me and Scott they're actually going to Newcastle very soon like this weekend actually he'll be going away um so yeah i'm trying to save my money but to be honest we did just go to leeds and i literally spent like almost all my wage on on leeds and stuff but like i'm not gonna be buying like too many clothes but it's just be more like pjs and just boring stuff probably um so yeah but i'm super happy Maybe for purchases in Superdrug and the Superdrug always has some good deals on. I actually signed up and got a new beauty card because I forgot it's from beauty card with me, Cinema. So at least I've got two on the go now, so I'll get double deals kind of thing, which is good. Um, but yeah, I'm just kind of waiting in the car. I'm, I'm hoping to be finished soon, but I'll, I'll be able to watch some TikToks or something in the car. Also, we tried to do a time lapse of the sunset last night and then in my phone must have switched off or something halfway through so you d you guys they wouldn't have been able to watch the full sunset which is quite sad but it's what it is you know it's fine i can't believe we're doing this oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god oh, coming home. it's coming home. <laughs> oh my god wait oh yeah yeah I look like a different person now, I've got makeup on and I'm still on my way to home bargains because I want to have a look for that like makeup like the carrier case because like this makeup artist or, or YouTuber has recently brought out a range at home bargains so I'm just gonna go to home bargains if I know where it is on my go to here um, and hopefully I'll have them because they're really cheap because obviously home bargains is cheap so I'm gonna have a look I'm back from home bargains is now everybody on like oh my god i look really weird with my eyebrows not filled in or like any highlighter on or any mascara like on my bottom lashes or barely like i used a bronzer 
as I used to, but it's a nice natural kind of colour. Anyway, I did buy a few things from Hall Bargains because I think, as I said before, with this makeup artist for her own range out, and I wanted to get like one of her makeup cases, but I actually sell them and only sold the brush ones. But I wanted a proper case, so I decided to go for a slightly more expensive one. It's the Olivia Hale one and it's like a like a massive one and it'll be really good for makeup and stuff because you open it up i'll actually show you all the, the, i think a few people they will be interested in this so like if you are interested in doing makeup or maybe you just want this for yourself just saw your makeup in open it up like so and then these just open outwards but like that the two layers and then like a massive bit underneath so and that was 20 pounds that was a good a bargain Let's see if I have that and then what did I also buy I, I bought there's some makeup remover cloths but I'll probably use these for skincare and these were 159 or something like that absolute bargain the colours are beautiful I love the colours so much I also got her makeup headband for doing my makeup in because it's really cute and that was like around 150 or something gorgeous I love my red and then finally I can't believe this yeah, they literally have a load of real technique stuff in there look at them what the hell so it, it's like a free pack of people and just put one of them it's like for powder makeup and one's for liquid no they want for powder and two is for liquid makeup but i'll use them for like whatever i'm using for anyway and it also comes with a 30 gram sponge cleanser oh my god that's so nice and you leave your guesses how much this was before I tell you all because it was a bargain. Three ninety nine for three sponges and a sponge cleaner. I'm really happy with that, and I'm all stocked up on these sponges now for a very long time. It is. It is. What's this? What's this? Hello. Hello. Oh. How beautiful. Are you two years old? Are you two years old now? Are you a big girl? Yeah, you are. Right, Barbie. Come on, Barbie. Hey, Ken. I'm just vlogging. Oh, you're beautiful. You look at her. The way she lies. I know. I love the way you lie. <laughs> <laughs> Shall I take you to work today? Oh, look at her. She's just so chilled out. To work? Oh, my God. She'd be just sat with everyone, wouldn't she? Yeah. He's leaving, he's leaving his work, like, yeah, by the way, I'm allowed to put you in the vlog. And like, you work, like, you work, her clothing in, what? Well, you're allowed to put my work uniform in anyway, really. All oh, right, okay. But it is. Don't tell the paparazzi to put my hair. <laughs> I don't know. It's, it's next day now, and I'm going to end the vlog. You can't go home, and Scott is going to work. You've and... been here two nights. I don't know, I, have, I can't believe it. It's so, lovely, hasn't it? I don't know. It's... I feel like you've been on holidays for us, but if you have enjoyed this vlog, make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below, and also subscribe, and we will see you all in our next Easy, video. Bye, everybody! See you later.